Game Show Network. All play, all day. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Jackie Calkin has already won $30,000. She is back to try to make it again to the bonus sprint. Today on Scrabble. A five-letter word. The clue is the outback. It's the crossword game you've played all your life, but never quite like this. And here's your host, Chuck Lowry. All righty. Thank you, Charlie. Tune in and welcome to the Scrabble, the television version of everyone's favorite game. Home viewer word was sent in by L.R. Robinson from Columbus, Ohio. Now, August is the month of our Scrabble Summer Sweepstakes. Every day this month, we're giving away uh, great prizes, a bunch of our official Scrabble T-shirts. Charlie's going to tell us what our winners uh, are going to be... <laughs> He's going to tell us what our winners are going to be getting today. Charlie? Chuck, today's Summer Sweepstakes winners will receive service merchandise gift certificate. Select top name brands from our catalog or redeem at any one of our many stores furnished by service merchandise. All right, now you're going to be able to choose from VCRs, TVs, video games, and much, much more. And at the end of the month, the uh, lucky winner one lucky winner, that is, will also get a dream vacation to Paradise Island in the Bahamas. So that ought to be fun. Uh, today, the jackpot in our bonus sprint stands at $6,000. The day winner today is going to get a chance at that jackpot. Charlie has our first two players. Charlie. She's our champion. He's a musician. From Anaheim, California, Jackie Culkin. And originally from Milano, Italy, Giovanni Lim. All right, nice to have you both here. Jackie is our champ with $30,000. Oh, well. Tell us more about yourself. You're probably tired of talking about yourself, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, I've said a lot about myself, but I just want to say thank you. This is my last day, and I'm... Oh, is this your last day? Yeah, and it's been fantastic, and the money's going to go to good use, and I really want to say thanks to everybody, and also thanks to my family, and I want to say hi to my mom and dad. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> well, that's nice. Good luck to you today, mom, Jackie. My dad. <laughs> And Giovanni, how are you? I'm fine. Tell me about yourself, Giovanni. Well, I'm a guitarist and a vocalist for a punk band in L.A. And uh, we haven't made any money, so can I say the name of the band? <laughs> sure. It's Jello Head. <laughs> now, now, where did you come up with Jello Head? Uh, well. A bunch of guys sitting around. You're eating Jello. No. Throw it on a guy's head. Hey. Well, our drummer's kind of dense, so he he looks like a Jello Head. Oh. So it's after him. Know that. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, each of our crossword players has the name of one of our home viewers in front of them, and the player who wins the game is going to tell us the viewer who wins. Is a gift certificate? That's what it is? Yeah, a gift certificate. I, do I seem a little lost? I'm a lot lost, folks, I'll tell you that. You're the challenger, Giovanni. going to go first. Here we go. Play Scrabble. If somebody gets three words right, that player goes on to our Scrabble sprint to get a chance that bonus worth 6000 uh, take a look at the board here. Building on the letter A, nine letters in the word. The clue is some wives have been caught red-handed in it. Some wives have been caught red-handed in it. That's All right. right. I do not know, so I will take the five and the nine. Well, now you got pink and blue squares. Uh, watch out for those. Five hundred and a thousand, as a matter of fact. M or a D? Uh, the M, please. And that's not going to work. Oh. Some wives have been caught red-handed in it. Jackie. Okay, I'll take tile number ten. R and a D? I'll take the D. First position in the word. And the R? Last position in the word. Some I don't know it. I'll take tile six and tile four. T or a W? Uh, the W. Some wives have been caught red-handed in it. And the T? OK, I'll take tile three and tile seven. C or an S? The S. Okay, I know it, and that sees a stopper. Some wives have been caught red-handed in it. Dishwater. That's it. <laughs> you know what threw me off the beginning of this show? I'm going to tell you. I'm, I'm looking at Giovanni while I'm saying. I expected you to have this thick Italian accent. Sorry. <laughs> Building on the letter A in dishwater, Giovanni. Okay. Seven letters in the word. The clue is, at the end of the night, he leaves girls feeling physic physically drained. <laughs> hmm. Oh, okay. dear. Well, it's 
not me, so. <laughs> I'll take number three and number seven. You know, my children watch this show. <laughs> you know that. I know it's innocent, but it's, well, go it's ahead. It's a family show. Uh, the R, please. At the end of the night, he leaves girls feeling physically drained. Ooh, the place to be. I've not had much luck with those, Jackie. No, not really. Okay, I'll take tile six and tile eight. D or a T? I'll take the D. And I think that T is a stopper. Is it Dracula? That's right, yes. Come in, man. Can you believe it? I mean, it I looks can't. like every time I read this, I'll look at her and she goes, and she has that look like, <laughs> I got it. Well, let's try this one more time, Giovanni. Now, All you've right. got to get this one, okay? Mm -hmm. Building on the letter A in Dracula, nine letters in the word. The clue is, they have a group practice. I'll give you $500 <laughs> if you can tell me what it is right now. They have a group practice. Want to take a chance? Try? Jello head. <laughs> no? No? I guess not. <laughs> And I'd like to introduce some members of the band, one by one. You know we have to accept that? <laughs> yeah, I Go ahead. Take attack. a couple of times. Okay, I'll take the five and the six. L or an M? Uh, place the M. They have a group practice. They have a group. They L, please. Boy, I can't, I just can't get by those things. Jackie. Okay, I'll take tile three and... Tile 11. T and an S. The S. Last position in the word. And the T. First position in the word. They have a group practice. OK, I don't know it. I'll take tile 2 and tile 9. K or an M? The M. And the K. No, now you have a chance to make some money, right. Giovanni. Well, $1,000 possible up there. OK, then I will take the 7. And the one. E and an A. Could you repeat the... They have a group practice. They have a group practice. The E. Well, if you ever wanted to take a oh chance, this is the time for $1,000. Teammates. Hit oh, it. teammates. That's exactly right. It's teammates. <laughs> Very close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. Thank you, John. <laughs> Bell means we're out of time. Hands on your buzzers. Don't answer till I say go. We'll put the letters in place one at a time. Last one's up to you. Jackie's going for the game. Giovanni's trying to tie it up. We're building on the letter E and teammates. There are six letters in this word, and the clue is he finally got the point. Ready? Go. He finally got the point. Jackie. Caesar. That's exactly right. It is Caesar. Well, listen, you got away unscathed. You got a thousand dollars. That's not too bad, you know. Good luck to you and your group, and thanks Thank for coming you. on the show. And let's see, let's see who won the uh, service merchandise gift certificate. Okay, Mrs. W. N. Rogers from Altamonte Springs, Florida. All right, and Mrs. Rogers, you get to go in and try out for the vacation. You got that great gift certificate. You, on the other hand, get another 500. One, One two, two, three, four, four five. That makes it 31,000, and a chance for some more. We'll be back. This classic episode of Scrabble is brought to you in part by Coca-Cola. Can't beat the real thing.
You'll never know what to expect on Three's a Crowd. That's my... Watch Three's a Crowd, 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific, Saturdays on Game Show Network. And now, back to Scrabble and Chuck Woolery. T-shirts. I got T-shirts here. Joe Antonoff from Valencia, California got a T-shirt. And Marie Kramer from Battle Creek, Michigan got a T-shirt. Getting those things away. Congratulations to you folks. Uh, Jackie Calkin has $31,000. Got a chance to establish a uh, time. Next one of the next crossword will try to beat that time. Remind you to uh, hit your plunger. That's what stops the clock. And no stoppers. All the letters are good. Good luck. First word, five letters. He writes comic books. He writes comic books. Ready? Ready. Go. B. Y. C. Right. Cosby. Yes. Yeah. Does he really write comic books? I didn't know that. Books uh, about comics. Uh, books about com Oh, um, I thought he had some kind of comic book. He does everything else. I, think. I got you. Okay. <laughs> Second word, six letters, a strapless gown. A strapless gown. Ready? Ready. Go. S. A. Sarong. That's right. <laughs> the third word has eight letters. They're relieved. They're relieved. Ready? Ready. Go. T. Pictures. Yes! The last word, nine letters. It's a touching experience. It's a touching experience. Ready? Ready. Go. H. Handshake. That's it, 11.1. That's got to be close to some kind of record of a count. Gee, that's just great. Those were not that easy. You could have gone a lot of different ways on those, too. That's the best you've ever done, yeah, isn't that's it? The way, yeah, by now, is that any kind of record, or is she close? What? Yes. It is a record? Yeah. Oh, my God. Well, like, what kind of record? We got so many records. Which, what is it? The lowest. That's the lowest time for four. That's the lowest time for four, the fastest? Well, congratulations. <laughs> Good for you. Yeah. That is just terrific. <laughs> Couldn't happen to a nicer person. Oh, thanks. Okay, we're going to see if somebody can match this time. <laughs> Good luck. We'll be back. <laughs> Stay with us. Congratulations. on Game Show Network. It's the coolest quiz show on television. Get ready for awesome prizes, high-tech action, and host Bob Bergen. Move over, Jeopardy. Here comes Jeff. And then, he's David Sedoni. She's Cyber Lucy. And together, they host Wheel 2000, the most exciting game show on wheels. Buying a vowel has never been this much fun. Catch Jeff, followed by Wheel 2000, next on Game Show Network. Jackie is our champion. And uh, all of our winners in the Scrabble Summer Sweepstakes, including our T-shirt winners, are going to get a chance at that dream vacation. Right now, Charlie's going to introduce our next two contestants. Charlie? She juggles the books. He's a technical climber. Originally from Kenosha, Wisconsin, Jill Goldmont. And from Los Angeles, Scotty Ernstein. All right, nice to have you both here. How are you, Jill? Hi. Tell me about yourself. Well, as Charlie said, I juggle, and it's a hobby of mine. And then during the daytime, I do accounting work to earn my moolah. What's the, what's the biggest thing you ever juggled? Oh, I can't say that on TV. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea. For, I don't know what she's talking about. It's Are a you... family show. Well, I don't know. Is this, does she do some kind of juggling that I don't know about? No, no, just normal three juggling. things. <laughs> well, I'm just dying to know now. <laughs> After uh, the show, Chuck. <laughs> ah, okay. Hate to do that to you folks, but I didn't know I was getting into there. Uh, Scotty, tell me about yourself. Well, I'm a technical climber, and I enjoy all sorts of activities, but 
Technical climbing is my newfound love. What's the toughest thing you ever climbed? Scott? No, never mind. Don't answer that. <laughs> <laughs> Who won the toss back? I did. Let's go to the board. <laughs> Building on the letter A, nine letters in the word. The clue is, oh, what is a technical climber? You use protection, ropes, webbing, harnesses to ascend the face of a cliff. Why well, I'd use all that. So would I. Stairs probably wouldn't hurt either. <laughs> Building on the letter A, nine letters in the word, and the clue is they're sometimes found lying in the gutter on New Year's Eve. They're sometimes li found lying in the gutter on New Year's Eve. That's right. Three, six. N or a T? T. And the N. Well, that's a stopper, Jill. Well, I don't know. I'll take the 11. And the seven. E or an S? Oh, how about that S? They're sometimes found lying in the gutter on New Year's Eve for $500, uh, Jill. I don't know. The E? <laughs> what uh, could you have juggled? To try to... <laughs> I'll do the tile. Sorry, folks, I have an entirely different game show going on in my mind right I now. I took the 10. Uh, I'm taking the five. M or an E? The M? The E? They're sometimes found lying in the gutter on New Year's Eve. Let's see, two stoppers out. I'm going for the money. Yeah. Nine. R. And the four. And a G. I'll take that R. And there's the G, the stopper. Streamers. Are sometimes found lying in the gutter on New Year's Eve. Yeah. Okay, Scotty, building on the letter A in streamers, there's seven letters in this word. The clue is some congressmen have pushed them through the house. All righty. Three. And the seven. A or a U? Try the U. And the A. Stop her. Some congressmen have pushed them through the house. Jill? I'll take the nine and the six. Another U. And an M. The M? $500. Oh. Some congressmen have pushed them through the house. Ah, uh, the U? Oh. Oh. Vacuum. That's right, it's vacuum. Well, Scotty, bell means we've run out of time. Going to play uh, speed words, so hands okay. on your buzzers. Don't answer till I say go. We'll put the letters in place one at a time. Last one's up to you. Building on the letter M in vacuums. Nine letters in the word. The clue is some guys prefer theirs pleasingly plump. Some guys prefer theirs pleasingly plump. Ready? Go. Some guys prefer theirs pleasingly plump. Scotty. Pumpkins. Well, you're out of it. Jill, you're all by yourself. Some guys prefer theirs pleasingly plump. You want to continue? Yep. You go. Dumplings? That's it. It's all over with. Yeah. Well, why don't you take yourself out of there like that? It's just, you know, but you had to kind of go for it. And you're so far behind. Thanks for coming on the show, Scotty. Sorry you didn't do a little better, but we do have a watch for you. And uh, before I move away, Charlie's going to tell you about this watch. Scotty, for you, Benra's his or hers nugget style gold tone watches. Black dial with six genuine diamonds. Sweep second hand. Precision quartz movement. Furnished by Benra's. Oh, well, I hope you enjoy that. Thanks again, Scotty. And Jill, let's see, open our envelope and see who we got here, okay? okay? They win the gift certificate. This is Leonard Hughes from Fayetteville, Tennessee. From Fayetteville, Tennessee. Okay, we got a lot of Tennessee folks in here. Good for you. So, I gotta, excuse me just a minute. I'm just gonna, <laughs> gonna just, just a second. Now, John. Tell me, tell me what it is. Just whisper in my ear. Oh. <laughs> just whisper, just, just whisper. Not now. <laughs> I'll set my dog on you, Chuck. No, <laughs> I gotta know this. We'll be back. <laughs> and I'll tell you if I can. This summer, Chicago, whatever you do and wherever you go, Coca-Cola Classic will be there. It's the one soft drink enjoyed across the nation five million more times every day than any other. Coca-Cola Classic, America's favorite under the sun. 
ride Rolling Thunder and get $4 off gate admission to Great America with an empty can of any one of these Coca-Cola products. And ride the thunder. Coming up next on Game Show Network. Gene Rayburn, Jamie Lee Curtis, Charles Nelson Riley, Joan Collins. Check out all the stars on Match Game. Oh, we're just one big happy family. And then, where can you learn all there is to know about your favorite celebrity couples? On Tattletales. Join Bert Convy and get intimate with the stars. Oh, George, it's just... Catch Match Game next on Game Show Network, followed by Tattletales at 9.30 p.m. Eastern, 6.30 p.m. Pacific. Scrabble and Chuck Woolery. All right, Jackie Calkin has $31,000. She's established a record time of 11.1 seconds. Can you believe that, Jill? You had to run up against this one. Mm -hmm. And uh, on top of that, she beat the old record by 2. Point what? 2.6 seconds, something yeah. like that? So that's, you know, in six years, that's, <laughs> that's quite an accomplishment. Jill uh, Goldmont has $500, and uh, she's going to try to beat the time. Before I get to this, let me mention a couple of people who got T-shirts. Marion Higgins from Glendale, New York, got one. And uh, Donna Nitraziba, I believe that is, or Nitraziba. Nitraziba. <laughs> she's in Sirotis. Uh, <laughs> she's from down here in California, folks. That's where she's from. And uh, they got T-shirts and got a chance at that vacation. So you're going to play the same four words. Remind you to hit your plunger. That's what stops the clock. No stoppers. All the letters are good. And here we go. First word has five letters. He writes comic books. He writes comic books. Ready? Go. Go. B. Y. S. He writes comic books. Bosby? Ah. And that's going to take you out of it. You only have five points. It's Cosby. Cosby. Uh, Cosby. Yeah. Well, <laughs> well, you did it again. But, you know, that's got to be a little intimidating to step up against 11.1 seconds anyway, Jill. But you have $500 in our thanks. Thanks for coming on the show. And uh, Jackie's up to 32000 She just keeps on giving more and more money. Going to come back and try for that bonus of six. We'll do it right after this. Stay Ghostbusters 2 Ectomobile. Just grab an entry form where Coca-Cola Classic is sold. We dare you to send it in. So become a Ghostbuster. See if we care. <laughs> Get ready to play. Join your favorite celebrities and host Alan Ludden on Password Plus. This is more than just Password, you know? It's, just it's Password Plus. Catch Password Plus every weekend on Game Show Network. And now, back to Chuck Woolery and today's winner. Another T-shirt recipient, Avis Nesset from uh, Gilbert, Minnesota. She's got a, uh, got a T-shirt coming to her. Oh, come on, win this, will you? Just go out with this, all okay. right? Okay, <laughs> I want you to win this thing. $6,000. Two words under 10 seconds. It's your last day, kiddo. Last time at bat. Finish it off with a bang. First word, six letters. It takes guts to play it. It takes guts to play it. Okay. Ready? Ready. Go. I, violin. That's right, 9.1 seconds left. Oh, you gotta get this one. Seven letters with 9.1 seconds to place them. Okay. Fuzz busters. Fuzz busters. Ready? Ready. Go. H. S. Fuzz busters. A. Shavers. You got it, kiddo. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. Well, these are <laughs> these are all of our contestants that haven't come up yet, and so they're being her they're being her family here. And uh, Jackie's going to walk off with thirty-eight thousand dollars. Congratulations! And uh, come back over here, sweetie. If there's if there's anything you want to say, then I know you're happy. You can say it now. Um, it's a good time. Hi, Chris. 
<laughs> Got it. Chris is going home saying, hi, 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 money, good. 38,000. Congratulations, thanks. sweetie. You know, good, good luck to you in school. Oh, thanks. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye, everybody. Come on down, sweetie. It's rowdy, it's raucous, it's outrageous wrestling action on WWF Monday Night Raw, tonight at 9. Now, buckle up and get ready for exciting action with David Hasselhoff and Knight Rider, next on USA. Exposure Unlimited. This program is based on the Scrabble brand crossword game. This is Charlie Tuna speaking. Travel is a red friendly production.